meet Gabriel Lillian Nassif, superstar Frenchman. You know, it took 1,100 matches to reach his first Pro Tour, but since then, he's managed a top 8 berth at PT or GP every year since. Here's some Nassif numbers. After second place at London, teammates Nassif, Tenenbaum and Olivieri made it to the final of Pro Tour New York 2001, Kai Buda and friends taking the crown. GP Prague was his trip to the top eight in 2002, with PT Venice the following year. Then came a golden 12 months, where the cool cat in the hat was the dominant force in the game. PT New Orleans saw him get his third runners-up spot behind Ricard Osterberg. Extended became block for PT Kobe when Nassif reached the final against Masashiro Kuroda, the Frenchman again just falling short. On to Worlds 2004, Nassif making yet another top eight to take the Player of the Year title. Hello and welcome to Pro Tour Atlanta. Team victory came in 2005 when Atlanta was the stage for Nassif, Gab Sang and David Rude to take the title. Worlds 06 saw his Marta Proclamation deck almost break the top eight scoreboard. Back in harness with Tenenbaum, Grand Prix Amsterdam saw him second again. Even at two in the morning, the trademark grin and love of the game was evident. Near misses and heart-stopping actions seemed to follow Nassif around. Take the semi-final versus Patrick Chapin from Worlds 07. Needing to avoid Ignite Memories five times, we Great saw shot. this, and this, oh, and more. this, Great Great shot. Shot. and this, and uh, yes. this. Goodness! Give him a six to five! Five copies of Ignite Memories! Holy wow. Thing is, even then, Chapin advanced to the final. His astonishing sixth final defeat came at Grand Prix Brussels in 2008. And then, the moment. In desperate trouble in the top eight of Pro Tour Kyoto 2009, Nassif needed a mighty top deck. Sly smile on his face. my ultimatum mana. <laughs> oh, there's his ultimatum mana. That's the card that he wants. Cruel ultimatum is the card he's hoping to top deck. And... Oh! Oh, my God! The top! This time, nothing would go wrong. In a great final, Nassif saw off Louis Scott Vargas in a five-game thriller. It took 2,852 matches, but now he stood on top of the world with the trophy to prove it. And then he won Grand Prix Chicago two weeks later. See, if at first you don't succeed, one of the best ever, Gabriel Nassif.